I live within the myths of my stories. Too magnanimous to be supported in deceptive power of appearance, creating my impractical ideas by unconscious transfers of my pretext. I am miss collectively traveling by conceptions of past generations, and those genes adapt or become extinct, engulfed by invented complexity, not progressing past its evolution. I function on irrational levels, powerless to make balanced decisions, oblivious to how selfish I am, thwarting new avenues and remedies to seek factual knowledge, then belief. I know miss with its unverified facts. As problems override cognitive skill in dangerous avenues of belief, based on predisposition and not facts, then substituting the facts with belief. I have appealed to lying instruments, repressing spiritual and truth input, straightforward to manipulate studies from systematic bodies of knowledge to pervert all its branches of science. I support my fragmented arguments like the stage of an unreserved eclipse when its light is entirely obscured, losing the totality points of view, finding pieces of my disagreement. I travel facts generally believed, closing my engagement with certainty, hiding my truth where no one else has been, as my wisdom is not comprehended in my unrecorded world of all myths. I have left my truth with a pawnbroker as security against exposure, held hostage like a lowly deprived pawn, progressing one square forward at a time with an optional first move of two squares. I have cheated by slighter lies uncaught behind the back of my motionless eyes, telling companions I was lost, not late, claiming sickness to get out of something, praising the cook when I wanted to gag. I have lived through my substantial falsehoods, bragging assets that can be converted into commodities of one-night stands, swooping value for the lies of others, for the myth of being a stud fucking. I have known myths like employing weapons, Increasing its false sophistication, like the remote operators seated, using guided missiles to tongues and poles, like video gamesters hurled down from miss. I have known miss at supersonic speeds, destroying my unloved genes passing down, cutting all the abrasive and hurtful sewing up my unzipped irritation through mists of conquest and truths of defeat. I know mists have destructive potential, employing deliberate deception by dark, repeated behavior patterns beyond being socially misleading by despondence of falsehood habits.
I am not kept prisoner by these myths, with freedom to exchange myths for my truth, when my fear is not my motivator, frightening me like panic reverence by the anticipation of danger. I look for others in my alignment, instead of convincing those who are not. There I have no fear of denigration between dreadful sarcasm and hubris, concealing their antagonist miss. I rid myself of offensive habits, converting miss to different energy, increasing the current voltage of truth.